Eight Signs and Symptoms of Kidney Stones You Need to Know Ever wondered about those tiny troublemakers lurking within your kidneys? Well, today we're diving deep into the enigmatic world of kidney stones, those microscopic troublemakers that can turn into a major pain, literally. From their formation to the symptoms that signal their presence, and the ultimate guide to diagnosis and treatment, we've got it all covered. So, buckle up for a kidney odyssey at Healthy 100, where we explore the ins and outs of kidney stones, turning this community into a support network for kidney warriors. Stay curious, stay healthy, and let's jump into the intriguing world of kidney stones together. What is a kidney stone? On the inside of the kidneys, tiny solid deposits of mineral and acidic salts can develop into kidney stones. Kidney stones, as their name suggests, resemble little pebbles and can range in size, from a grain of sand to a pea, major problem, texture, smooth or jagged, and color, often yellow or brown. They can grow to be as big as a golf ball in unusual and terrifying cases. According to the NIDDK National Institute of Diabetes and Digestive and Kidney Diseases, the minerals that make up kidney stones, calcium, oxalate, and phosphorus, are usually present in urine and do not pose any problems when consumed in little quantities. According to the Mayo Clinic, minerals can crystallize and form clumps when the urine gets more concentrated, which can occur because of factors including dehydration. Kidney Stone Symptoms a kidney stone might be present without the patient's knowledge. Such is frequently the case with small kidney stones, which might exit the body unnoticed. We either don't locate many of them at all, or come upon them by chance while searching for anything else. Kidney stone symptoms are no less unpleasant, though. Get medical attention immediately if you notice any of these symptoms, since they may indicate kidney stones. Your doctor will be able to diagnose the problem and provide medication. One. Sharp pain in your side and below your ribs. Speaking about that dreaded agony. As soon as the stone moves out of the kidney and into the ureter, the small tube that connects the kidneys to the bladder, the process typically starts. If the stone is large enough to block the ureter, urine can back up into the kidney, which can lead to swelling and severe discomfort. Sharp, acute, and frequently abrupt pain is what you may expect. Traditional locations for its sensation include the flanks, or the area just below the rib cage on both sides of the body. A general rule of thumb is that the larger the stone, the more difficult and painful it is to pass. However, even pebbles can cause pain. It is important to seek emergency care if the pain is severe enough to prevent you from sitting still or finding relief. 2. Pain that comes and goes. The Mayo Clinic reports that pain that comes on suddenly or varies in severity is also common. As the ureteral muscles work to move the stone forward, the pain may come and go, gradually worsening and then improving slightly. If the pain returns, it might mean something significant is happening, but at first you might assume it was simply a random unexplained blip. 3. Pain in the stomach or groin the discomfort surrounding the kidney may go to the groin or abdomen. This is due to the fact that discomfort can change places as it travels down the urinary system. Although it can seem strange that your pain is changing, this is a common indication of kidney stones. 4. Nausea and vomiting. Some sufferers become so uncomfortable that they begin to puke up. Whichever other kidney stone symptoms you may be experiencing, this is an obvious indication that something extremely terrible is wrong with your body. And, of course, it can exacerbate the discomfort and other symptoms associated with kidney stones. 5. Fever and chills. This suggests that you could also be experiencing an infection. Urinary tract infections can lead to the formation of some stones. Fever is a typical sign that a urinary tract infection, UTI, has progressed to the kidney or upper urinary tract system. Six. Cloudy or foul-smelling pee. These are also typical indications of a kidney infection. Thus, depending on the specifics of your situation, they could potentially manifest as kidney stones. 7. Red, pink, or brown urine. This is an indication of blood in the urine because a passing stone has nicked blood vessels in the tissue lining your urinary system. But frequently, the amount of blood is so small that a urinalysis test to check your urine would be the only way to detect it. 8. Urinating frequently 
and or only peeing a small amount at a time. These urogenital feelings usually start when the stone is irritating the bladder or obstructing the urine's flow. Knowing exactly what you're dealing with may become perplexing because these problems might also be indicators of other medical diseases, such as urinary tract infections. Kidney stone causes. The kind of kidney stone determines its etiology. A medical ailment or urinary tract obstruction may be the direct reason. However, kidney stone causes are often unknown. It may be a combination of genetics, medical conditions, and food. According to the NIDDK, Kidney stones may be caused by not drinking enough water and having a family history of kidney stones. It may also be a mix of chronic intestinal inflammation, renal difficulties, and recurrent UTIs. However, there are four basic kidney stone varieties based on their composition and cause. 1. Calcium stones The U.S. National Library of Medicine reports that up to 75% of kidney stones are these. When bones and muscles don't need calcium, the kidneys drain it out with urine. The NIDDK says calcium can form a tiny stone in the kidney when it builds up and binds with waste materials. This might develop for unknown reasons or due to a medical disease that generates excess calcium in the urine or blood. Hypercalciuria, hyperoxaluria, hyperparathyroidism. 2. Uric acid stones. Overly acidic urine can cause these. Eating fish, shellfish, and meat, particularly organ meat, or being dehydrated, might cause this. Gout, genetics, and other factors can raise uric acid stone risk. 3. Struvite stones. They develop soon after a UTI. They can also grow quickly, causing kidney stone symptoms that are unexpected. 4. Cysteine stones. Cysteine stones are caused by cystinuria, a hereditary disease that leaks cysteine from the kidneys into the urine. How kidney stones are diagnosed clinicians can identify kidney stones with many methods. After discussing your symptoms and performing a physical exam, your doctor may request these tests. Urinalysis. This test detects kidney stone forming substances in urine. A urinalysis can detect blood, germs, and white blood cells in urine. The last two could indicate that you have a UTI. Blood tests. Your doctor may test your blood for kidney stone causing substances. Abdominal x-ray. This image might reveal kidney stones in your urinary tract. One big caveat. X-rays cannot reveal all kidney stones. CT scans. CT scans employ X-rays and computer technologies to produce urinary tract pictures. Contrast media, a dye, or other material may be injected to make particular body parts easier to view during imaging studies. Kidney stone treatment treatment approach will be based on specific diagnosis as well as the type of stone, its source, its position, and the symptoms. Passing tiny stones may frequently be accomplished with patience, enough drinking, and over-the-counter painkillers to dull the discomfort. Additionally, your doctor may recommend an alpha blocker, which facilitates easier stone passage by relaxing the ureter. More extensive treatment may be required for larger stones that are obstructing your urinary system, causing excruciating discomfort, or both. This might involve a treatment to break up or remove the stone, as well as pain medication and IV fluids to control the discomfort and dehydration from vomiting. For example, doctors can employ sound waves to break up the stones or a surgical treatment to remove it. How to prevent kidney stones. The sort of kidney stone you have and your medical history will determine what may be done to avoid more ones. Prevention methods might include drinking lots of water, changing your diet to include less salt or animal protein, or using different drugs to help control the amounts of certain minerals in your urine. And there you have it, folks. The ultimate guide to the enigmatic world of kidney stones. From their humble beginnings as microscopic troublemakers to the potential pain and symptoms they can bring, we've covered it all. If you found this video informative, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and hit that subscribe button for more mind-expanding content. Thanks for joining us on this Kidney Odyssey at Healthy 100. Feel free to watch other videos in our channel to live a healthier life. Until next time, take care. Bye.